Hey everybody, look on the screen. Unfortunately, this is a teacher who is no longer with us. Let's look at this uh, news clip, part A, and then uh, we'll have part B, which will be uh, a separate video for the commentary. Check it out for you. Now know the woman Sean killed inside an apartment building in New Jersey was a teacher for Jersey City Public Schools. And we have learned that police have also made an arrest in the case. That shooting happened this morning on Bergen Avenue in Jersey City. Eyewitness News reporter Anthony Johnson spoke to someone who heard the gunfire. He joins us live with more. Anthony. Yeah, the shooting happened around 7.15 this morning on the third floor of this building. The daughter of the victim is the one who called police and told them who the suspect was, and they were able to capture that man this afternoon in Pennsylvania. Hmm. We got a female victim, multiple gunshots. It was a shocking call from a 15-year-old that led police to the third floor hallway of the toy factory apartments. Neighbors of the victim say all they heard was gunfire. Bang, 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 and that was it. So you heard the shots this morning? Yes, I time. did. I was going to walk out. It was around 7.15, 7.10, around there, because I just came from the store buying some stuff. The victim was found shot multiple times and died. She has been identified as Tamara King, a third-grade school teacher with a master's degree working in Jersey City. The district issued a statement regarding the tragedy this afternoon, stating, Our hearts are broken at the sudden loss of Tamara King. She was an outstanding teacher and educated member of our district. She will be missed, and our prayers go to her family and friends as they cope with this tragedy. She suffered from multiple gunshot wounds. <sighs> we got a, a, a pulse right now. Many of the family and friends gathered near the home of Tamara King's mother in Jersey City. They were too consumed with grief to speak. But cops were able to talk to the teen who heard a fight between her mother and father just before the gunfire. She heard her mother and father arguing this morning. The motive for the tragedy is unclear, but the suspect, identified as 39-year-old Lucas Cooper, is now in custody near Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. He doesn't have a residence. He lives out of his vehicle. And once again, Cooper was taken into custody this morning, or rather this afternoon, near Pennsylvania. He has now been charged with murder and criminal possession of a weapon. A friend of the family tells me the couple was getting divorced. Okay, people, you saw part A. Stick around, please, for part B, the commentary.